Irene ahead to the tent, Miss Grand San Juan City. So, Adika Aqua Boracay, I'm Bea Fajardo, Miss Grand Salunardo. Tabana Vergara, your Miss Grand Sarangani. Magandang gabi. I'm Queen Jubilee Moncupa, your Miss Grand Socorro, Quezon City. Boracay. I am Jaira Shamaini Tapan Bantas, your Miss Grand Tantangan, Province of South Cotabato! Maya Pabengi po, kaya kayo nga? My name is Francine Fari Machanko Reyes, your Miss Grand Tarlock Province! I'm Catherine Camilon, Miss Grant, Tui Batangas! Faith Hetherick, Miss Grant, Urdaneta City! These ladies are really bringing up the heat, right? That's right, Janelle. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a warm round of applause once again for the Miss Capital Beach candidates. You know, everyone, these ladies have gone through a lot for the past few weeks, and to see them transform into a powerhouse of beauty and confidence before our eyes are really something so empowering, right, Janelle? Nako, sinabi mo pa, Rihanna. Thanks to the Miss Grand Philippines organization for giving them a platform to all our candidates to showcase the grandest versions of themselves. Not only that, this is exactly what Miss Grand Queens are known for. An ambassadors of overflowing confidence, a true epitome of a woman that is unapologetically herself, and a representation of a feminine energy that gradually builds to become a star. I couldn't have said it any better, Janelle. A round of applause to all our candidates again for embodying everything she just said. Let's go, Aqua Barak, and let's give them a round of applause. All right, now that we have finally laid our eyes onto all our beautiful candidates, Janelle, I guess it's high time to know all the distinguished people that will gauge their performance tonight. That's right. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard what she said. Let's introduce our Board of Judges. Our first judge is a talent and model from ALV Talent Circuit, Mr. Mark Rivera. We also have Miss Tourism World 2022, first runner-up, Miss Justine Felizarta. The resort manager of Aqua Boracay, Ms. Pamela Guevara. Executive Director for Marketing at Aqua Boracay, Mr. Christopher Ko. And the man behind all these, the CEO, President of ALB Pageant Circle and the National of Miss Grand Philippines, 
Mr. Arnold Vega Fria. Just like what we heard before, what's, be what's a better place to stage a swimwear presentation than a place that's home of String of Islands featuring an astounding 22,500 miles of coastline and is brimming with extraordinary pristine beaches and white sand. An idyllic island worthy of all praises globally, Boracay. That's right. While there's no single place that encapsulates all the Pacific archipelago has to offer, this place comes close of bringing the smarter choice for everyone to have the taste of the best of the Philippines experience. The, the beauty of Boracay.
tiene la culpa que le gusta la maraca Te dentro de mi corazón.
Them, Honestly, they look so dazzling and stunning tonight. The judges are gonna have a really hard time trying to decide. Definitely, and I hope our audience here are enjoying. How are you, everybody? Yes, are you still with us? There you go. Yes, we love the energy. And, you know, let's just give them a round of applause once again, our candidates of Miss Grand Philippines 2023. Rihanna, actually, I was... They told me this a while ago. The ladies actually got to decide what they were wearing tonight. That's true. That's why everybody looks so different and unique from each other. And I think that's amazing because they get to express themselves more, right? And really express their creativity. And I'm sure their team are very much proud of them. Well, yes. I wanted to ask you something. How was your stay here in Aqua Baraka, Ariana? Oh my goodness. It's been lovely since day one. The food is amazing. The beds are so comfortable. How is everybody staying here in Aqua Baraka? Are you loving it? Yes! So thank you so much once again to Aqua Baraka for generously having us or sponsoring, of course, Miss Grand Philippines. How about you, Janelle? Is it your first time here in Aqua Baraka? Honestly, no. I was in Aqua Baraka just a month ago and wow. I'm so happy that I was able to come back even in a span of just a month. This is a crazy experience. For sure, and it's always lovely to be here in Barakay. And Sinu, but who else are here for the first time in Aqua Barakay? Can we see? Oh, 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 that oh. says a lot, Brianna. Yeah, that's true. We'd like to say hi, of course, to our Facebook uh, or YouTube viewers. Hello to all of you who are watching us live on our official YouTube and Facebook account. That is Miss Grand Philippines, MS Miss for Miss and of course Grand Philippines. Yes, okay. So please stay tuned because the hottest part is just about to start. Okay, so we'd like to hear some of the thoughts of our judges tonight. Hello, good evening to all of you. Let's start with the ever beautiful and dazzling Miss Justine Felizarta. How are you doing? And what are your expectations for tonight as you judge the candidates of Miss Grand Philippines? Hello, good evening everyone. It's such a beautiful night here in Aqua Barakay and even more beautiful ladies that showcase their confidence. And honestly, being a candidate before, it's so much harder being a judge now that I'm sitting here. So good luck to all the ladies. I know that they're gonna bring their 100% for the swimsuit portion. Definitely. Thank you so much, Justine. Hmm. <laughs> of course, let's ask our talent from ALV Talent Circuit. How hard is it to decide? Good evening to everyone. Actually, it's very tough. I didn't expect this competition between uh, uh, all the co contestants tonight. So, we'll see. I'm excited to see what they got for tonight's competition. Thank you so much. And Definitely. of course... Thanks, Mark. And of course, I heard tonight there will be special uh, awards and special surprises for our candidates. So, we'd like to hear from Mr. Christopher Call. Hi, sir. Good evening. So, what do you think about the whole event so far and what are you looking for into the winners later on? Um, so, so far it has been really fun and I think it's so hard to decide because everyone is like so good, like they're very elegant in how they walk and how they present themselves. And yeah, that's what I'm looking for, the elegance and how they present themselves. Thank you so much, sir. The elegance and how they present themselves, indeed. And of course, Miss Pamela, you look very <laughs> lovely tonight. <laughs> Hi, yes, good evening, Aqua so Burakai. 
so I'm actually crying myself right now. <laughs> so it's hard for us, like for me to decide, but I wish all the girls luck for tonight. Thank you so much, Miss Pamela. And of course, we can't miss our national director. <laughs> Any words? Well, I really would like to congratulate all the ladies who, you know, like our candidate. I saw the transformation, you know, from the time they just started during the audition until now. You see the difference, and you see the the improvement of every of every candidates. And I would like to thank the people behind them. Of course, their gla their their glam teams are the one also responsible for them. And the glam team of the Miss Grand Philippines, and also I would like to th also to include. Not only Miss Grand Philippines is that we're looking for. We have three crowns that we're doing, but giving, you know, on the on the coronation night. We also have the Miss Reina Hispano Americana, and of course the Miss Philippine Tourism. So we're giving three crowns on July 13 during our coronation night. So wow. thank you, congratulations to all the girls, and keep it up. And I'm sure. Um, there's going to be a uh, whatever who will be what will be the result and all of them if you'll ask me all of them are all qualified indeed thank you so much sir arnold and we are very much excited for the upcoming coronation night happening on july 13th at the mall of asia or sm mall of asia arena and of course to keep the ball rolling because it's a mood, a drama, art of self-expression, a feeling of confidence, and a grand celebration of womanhood. What a better place to stage a national pageant swimwear presentation than the world's famous beautiful white sand beach, Boracay Island. And what's a better place to stage it than Boracay's staple of where the biggest parties are held? Aqua Boracay. Give yourselves the ultimate party experience and increase your cool status by a hundred. This, this is Miss Grand Philippine Swimsuit Competition.
encontrado el amor.
que el tiempo es tiempo y no retorna. negar esta llama que despierto en tu corazón. No puedes negar esta llama que despierto en tu corazón. negar esta llama que despierto en tu corazón. Is it just me or it's really getting hot in here, Yana? 
My God, the athleticism, the walk, and the way that our Miss Grand candidates carried themselves in their swimwear are way too fiery to handle. Indeed, you said it. And it's not just us, Janelle. I'm sure everyone here surely couldn't contain the excitement after witnessing our swimsuit competition. Can you to keep our cool at a manageable level? Let's get serenaded by one of the promising actors of his time, ABS-CBN's The Good Son actor, Mark Rivera. Everyone, good evening, Boracay. Are you guys enjoying? You know the song, please join me. Are you ready? Thank you so much, Aqua Burakai! Give a round of applause to our contestants tonight for the Miss Grand Philippines swimsuit. Swim suit. Thank you so much. Special thanks to Aqua Burakai, especially to Mr. Tony Ko, Mr. Uh, Christopher Ko, and uh, thank you so much for having us in this beautiful place in Burakai. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the night. Good luck. To our contestants tonight, you guys did a great job. I know you guys give your all, your 100%. I saw your preparation, excitement. So good luck to all of you tonight. And uh, good evening to our beautiful host. Good evening to you, Mark. Let's give him a round of applause once again for a very good-looking crooner, Mark Rivera. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. 
We are now down to the announcement of the top candidates who aced this swimsuit competition. That's right, Janelle. Their performances here will determine the top 10 best in swimsuit. The first five we will announce tonight, and the remaining five will be selected through social media votes. The voting is now officially open, both on our official Facebook and Instagram accounts. FB page Miss Grand Phil, Instagram Miss Grand Philippines. To vote, you need to follow us on Facebook and on Instagram. All our official candidates' photos will be posted there. For Facebook, one like is equivalent to one point, one share is equivalent to two points, and on Instagram, one like is equivalent to ten points. You can now vote until 10 p.m. of June 30th. Again, now until 10 p.m. of June 30th. The top 10 best in swimsuit winners will be photographed in their official swimsuit and will be featured on the Miss Grand Philippines Facebook page cover. So don't forget to use the hashtags. Madami to guys, eight. Hashtag MGPHX Aqua Barakay. Hashtag Grand Side of Burakai, Hashtag MGPH Hashtag MGI Hashtag Grand Experiences Hashtag Miss Grand Philippines 2023 Hashtag Miss Grand International 2023 And Hashtag We Are Grand The One and Only That's right, Viana. We are Grand The One and Only So without further ado let us now announce the final, the first five candidates who will be part of the top 10 best in swimsuit. Yes, who do you think will make it to the top 10? Who do you think will make it to the first five cuts? We should ask our audience, who are your votes? We hear a mono right here. Yeah, I'm sure all the candidates really did their best and I'm excited for the results. May we call on, of course, the National Director of Miss Grand Philippines to award and announce the ladies who, will, who made it to the top 10 best in swimsuit. Mr. Arnold Vegafria. Let's give him a round of applause once again. Hi. Good evening to everyone. I'm going to announce the, the top five during the competition, but the other five will be announced on June 30, who won in the social media votes, right? Indeed. And there are a total of 10 winner, I'm 10 uh, finalists for best in swimsuit. Okay. The results the are in. Yes. The top five. For best in swimsuit, candidate from Kalaokan City, Sharon Tampon. Second candidate, the second finalist is from Bagumbayan, Quezon City, Michelle Arceo. Candidate from Tarlac, Francine Reyes. Our fourth finalist, candidate from Kaluya Antique. Charlie Manalo Serio.
And finally, candidate from Cagayan de Oro City, Nikki De Mora. Five finalists. The other finalists will be announced on June 30 via social media, right? Yes. Thank you so much, Arnold. Congratulations to our top five ladies. And indeed, we will be waiting for the remaining five. Thank you, sir. Congratulations, ladies, for doing a great job as well. I'm sure your efforts aren't... Your efforts are all seen. Everything wouldn't be possible if not for the genuine support of all our sponsors. The Miss Grand Philippines organization would like to extend our sincerest gratitude to ALV Pageant Circle, our presenters Aqua Burahai, Arena Plus, Ever Belena, our major sponsors Philippine Airlines, Bench, Bench Body, Blue Water Day Spa. We also would like to thank Hello Glow, My Diamond, Mermaid Manila Hair. Our donors are Powerhouse Studios, Amante Fleurs, Francis Chi, V. Co, Juan Chubendia, Jurel Valmores, the Municipality of Malay Aklan, Malay Municipal Police, Diamond Water Spots, Kiza R, Carvin Torne, Velvet Studio, The Platform, Piggy Papa, and King Fu. All right, once again, let's give our ladies a round of applause. And just to announce a few more, we have gone through a lot of free pageant activities, but we have more in store for all of you. So we will be having our charity gala happening on July 8th. And of course, our coronation night on July 13th at the SM Mall of Asia Arena. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, at this point, we would like to invite on stage the president of Thinline Advertising and the chief marketing consultant of Aqua Burajay, Mr. Frank Briones, to help us announce who among our 30 candidates were selected to be Aqua Burajay Grand Angels. Thank you very much, wonderful ladies. You were amazing. I would have thought you should be part of the contestants oh, okay. as well. Anyway, guys, creativity, fun, and more importantly, energy is the very essence of what Miss Grand International is all about. You know what, guys? What I have been observing for the past couple of hours is that these ladies have been giving you amazing energy, but you guys are not reciprocating. Let us give our 30 contestants a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Now, that is energy. But I think you can do better than that. Once again, the 30 contestants of Miss Grant International Philippines 2023! All right, guys, you know, we always say here at Aqua Boracay, we are at the better side of Boracay. Why do we say that? Number one, I don't know if you know, guys, but. Um, the Boracay stretch here at Balabog is probably the cleanest in the whole of the island. Of course, we'd like to thank our LGU for helping us with that. I think let us acknowledge the Vice Mayor of Boracay who's actually here right now, Nino. Nino. Nino, hello. That's Nino right there. Also, did you guys know that Aqua Boracay actually has the biggest premier suite in the whole of Boracay. So I want you guys to try it out. 650 square meter of luxury Ibiza suite, exclusive only here at Aqua Boracay. I think our host deserves a better applause than that. I say Aqua Boracay. Also, did you guys know that the very first and only fine dining in the whole of Boracay is actually here. That's Sea Dot Food by Chef Chele Gonzalez. And incidentally, it's also one of the best restaurants by Tatler Philippines. Give it up for Aqua Boracay. You know, I keep saying 
the better side of Boracay. But I realized just coming into the stage tonight, I think we just have to change it, at least for tonight or for the rest of the week. Our new hashtag, the grand side of Boracay. Thank you very much to our dear partners, ALV, ALV Productions. We are very honored to create history with you as the official partner of the very first Miss Grant International Philippines here 2023 at Aqua Boracay. Now you wonderful ladies, your journey towards that elusive golden crown is happening starting tonight. And you know what? It is our tradition here at Aqua Boracay to give you luck. Uh, you know, eight signifies luck in Chinese Feng Shui. It signifies infinity. So as you all journey towards that elusive golden crown, we have a special award that we're giving. It's actually a surprise. Would you want a special surprise from Aqua Boracay girls? But how can I give surprise if you're not giving me that energy? Do you girls want to be part of the Aqua Grand Angels? Okay, since this is luck, we are giving you an Ampau. With it, of course, is a special cash prize. We're choosing eight winners of what we call the Aqua Grand Angels. To help me announce this and to help me award, I would like to welcome the Chief Executive Officer of Aqua Boracay. Give it up for Tony Ko. Of course, he will be accompanied by the, orig the original, the grand dame of Aqua Boracay. Give it up to Miss Carol Ko! Right. The whole time a while ago, without you knowing guys, we have been secretly judging you over the past couple of days. We have also been monitoring a lot of Instagram postings, a lot of social media postings because we want to be able to determine who we feel could be the best, the potential best brand ambassadors of Aqua Boracay. So now we're choosing the top eight. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? I'm only hearing it from Kalo Akan. Are you guys ready? Amazing, amazing. All right, guys. Of course, there's a certain criteria that we had to observe when choosing the top eight. Of course, going through the, the very essence or the very core of what Miss Grand International is all about, three pillars, beauty, body, and brains. Do you guys think you have that? Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Okay, I want this to be a little bit more interactive. As I call each name, I want to hear you shout your favorite contestants. Are you ready? Now let's do it. Where do I, where do I stay? Okay, I'll stay here on the side. Let us begin. Our first Aqua Grand Angel goes to... Not very far away from Boracay, Antique! All right, let me escort this beautiful lady on the side. Antique, congratulations. Oh, guys, we have, oh, sorry there. 
we have seven more. Next up, we have Wildest Guess, guys. All right. <laughs> Let's just give Kalo Okan. Kalo Okan. <laughs> Congratulations, Kalo Oka. Congratulations, my dear. All right. Two down, six more to go. I just wanted to be a little bit more interactive. I, if I hear the province, I'll call it out loud, okay? The third, Aqua. Grand Angel goes to Nueva Ecija. Congratulations, Nueva Ecija. All right. Now on our fourth. We'll do it later. <laughs> You're the only one cheering. But anyway, let's give it a first four. La Union! <laughs> Halfway there, and I want to hear it from you guys this time. Who do you think will be our fifth Aqua Grand Angel? I want to hear it from you guys. All right, because you said it, Bagumbayan, Quezon City. Guys, our sixth Aqua Grand Angel goes to Darla! We have six, two more to go. You know, this is actually quite crucial because you know what, guys? In the tradition of us collaborating with different beauty pageants, we almost have the knack for it. You know what? That is not just an ampau. That is a lucky ampau that will carry you through the next golden crown or the very first golden crown for the Philippines. Now, let me announce the seventh. And the seventh Aqua Grand Angel goes to. Okay, just come here. Kakaya de Oro! You guys are doing it well, huh? Oh, 
Congratulations, my dear. All right, guys, this is the last. Now I want the loudest cheer. Who do you think will make the final cut? And the final awardee for Aqua Grand Angel goes to Socorro Quezon City! Congratulations, ladies, and we officially welcome you to the Aqua Boracay family. But you know what, guys? The surprise is not over because come July 18, during the culminating night, one of you will be awarded for the very first Miss Aqua Grand International Philippines to which you will win, possibly win, a round trip ticket for two to Boracay, full on board VIP accommodation at our premier suite. So that becomes your prize. One of these ladies could be your next Miss Grand Aqua Boracay. Congratulations, ladies! I will do my walk as well. Congratulations, ladies. A big round of applause for the eight Aqua Grand Angels. Now let me turn you over back to our beautiful host for tonight. Thank you very much. Thank you so Thank much, you so Grand Aqua Baraka is indeed the grand side of Baraka. And I'm sure our, our ladies are very much excited to witness more of what they can really get from Miss Grand Philippines and of course Aqua Barakai. So we couldn't start to describe how grateful we are to all of you that witnessed this grand celebration. It is such an honor to host the first ever Miss Grand Philippines swimsuit competition and truly an honor to be part of the grandest representation of beauty, confidence and female power. Let us not miss all the upcoming activities of Miss Grand Philippines by liking our official social media handles. For Facebook, we are Miss Grand Phil, that is M-S Grand Phil, P-H-I-L. And on in, in Instagram, we are Miss Grand Philippines, once again, M-S Grand Philippines. We invite everyone to like and follow all of it while you're at it. We will all see each other again at Miss Grand Philippines Gala Night on July 8th. And of course, the Miss Grand Philippines Coronation Night at Mo Arena on July 13. Everyone, I am Janelle Lewis, your Miss World Philippines 2021 Second Princess. And I'm Rihanna Agatha Bangandia, and your Miss World Philippines 2021 First Princess. A grandest evening to all of you. But every now and then you remind me when I'm lying in bed. Once again, this is Miss Grand Philippines Swimsuit Competition.
I remember, that's when I remember 